Hey guys, it's Caitlin. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today's gonna be a pretty exciting video. Today we're gonna do a college week in my life. Uh, finals edition. So, it is currently finals week. Um, today was reading day. I did not record today, mostly because I have not started studying yet. And it's 8.10 at night. And I have my first final at 11.30 tomorrow morning. <sighs> I also have some assignments that need to be finished. Obviously, this semester we went back in person. However, most of my professors, due to the rise in COVID cases and, you know, other factors into it, um, they've decided to have, at least all my finals are online, um, so I have my bio final tomorrow from 11.30 to 1.30, and then I have my poli-sci final, which has to be done by Thursday, I have my math final, which is a two-day process, she's giving us two days to finish it, which is really nice, um, I think that's the only finals I have to do, I have a last minute, well, not last minute, a last project for writing 235 that I'm taking, it's, that class has been a journey in itself. Um, but yeah. Also, I have no motivation to study, but we have no choice. But let's go. <laughs> we're on coffee number two of the day, and we're on, we're on coffee drink number three. I got this new creamer flavor for me. Sweet cream. Um, cold stone one. Actually really good. So currently 10.46 and I have 11 more countries to go um yeah and then once I finish the countries I'm going to finish the study guide for bio work on that a little bit and then go to bed and then probably wake up at like 8 and then do a last minute studying and then after my exam tomorrow I have to do my presentation with my partner for my 235 class and then that class will be done after, well, after that's done, then I have to finish everything for that class. And then pre-calc is next. I have to do my public relations exam. And other than that, pretty much it. So once I finish this, I'll be good to go. But I have to go charge my camera because it's yelling at me that it's almost dead. So I'll see you guys a little bit later. It's 11.28 and I just submitted my coding for my poli sci class and i am so happy that's done i could have done a little bit better um for about 25 of the countries like my law wise but i'm just so exhausted so the other 150 are fine so if i get like an, i think it's worth like an 85 um but the final coding i don't even know how much it's worth in my final grade because we had like so many projects so, hey guys, it's currently 10.41 in the morning, and it is bio exam day, and yeah. So, the exam's at 10, 11.30, and it closes at 1.30, so we have two full hours to do it, but it's obviously going to take the two full hours, so I'm doing studying right now. I have a meeting at 2 o'clock, and then we're going to do that, ex that project, and then after that, I'm going to do my public relations exam get that over with I mean it's pretty simple pretty easy just um, 10 words have to define um, and that's my major course so and then I might go back over my coding later and redo the 25 30 countries that kind of were crap explanations um, just want to pop in here I did not redo my coding um, I got an A in the class which I'm still shocked about but I'll take so I did not uh, redo my coding, but honestly, there was 196 countries that were coded and I only felt iffy about like 25 of them. So honestly, a majority of them I felt really good, so I wasn't too concerned. We also had a bunch of projects throughout the semester that would have made up for anything I did bad on, so back to the video. But, you know, I think I'm still going to be on the thing. And then tomorrow is the 16th. So my next exam is not until the 17th um, for my pre-calc, which if I get a 70 on it, I will pass the class. So, so all I need is a 70 to pass the class. A 
Okay, listen, don't be like me and really have to worry about the final exam grades past class, but also in a way, I feel like we're all like this, so don't judge. I passed the class in the end, but you'll see me go through a lot of struggles during this video <laughs> over that class, but I passed, okay? But back to the video. But I think I'll get, I, I'll try my best to get like an 80, that's my goal. Um, my last exam I got an 84, the exam for that was a 92, my first exam was a 68, so <laughs> I'm a little nervous, but I think we can handle it. But yeah, I'm gonna finish my studying, charge my laptop because it's gonna die. Um, I took a shower, this way my hair looks like crap, um, needs to be brushed out, but we're gonna get ready. Two minutes. Two minutes, Ryan. I don't mean to interrupt this again, but just in case the university finds this video, I don't need them saying this. We did not cheat off each other. We followed the academic, academic honesty. Wow. Um, yeah, either way, the two exams were different in a way because as we all know, when we take an exam in person, there's like four or five different versions of it. Even on Brightspace, through the computer, they're different versions. And we also didn't even get close to the same grade, so I just want to say that because I don't need problems down the road. But back to the video. Honestly thought I failed that. I can't believe. I finished by with an 89.37. that I got an 89.37 but it is what it is so it is currently 127 I'm finishing up this stuff for my 235 class um, getting the last video out putting on YouTube so then I can put it in the dyad and then once that's done also I look horrible in all these videos but it's okay um, once that's done I have my meeting at two. We're just gonna record ourselves like talking about it and all of that and yeah. And then after that, I'll probably take a nap and then we're going to go do my other stuff. So it's currently 2.41 in the morning and I'm doing my public relations exam because it's due tomorrow at 10.45. Um, I'm almost done with, well, almost halfway done with it. Carmen was here so that's why I am still I haven't done it yet. After I do that, we have to go down to URI later today, technically. So I can go get a COVID test. But yeah. So I'm gonna finish this up and go to bed. It's 3 in the morning and I see this my exam. Now it's time for bed. Okay guys, so it is currently 9.07 in the morning. And we're currently currently at my mom's doctor's appointment um i'm in the car i think i'm gonna move up to the front and turn the car on because it's kind of cold um but after this we're gonna go down to your eye so i can go get a covid test because we're not that far from campus and then I also i did my public relations exam at two o'clock in the morning as i told you um honestly i don't know how well i did because again i did it at two o'clock in the morning but I, I think I did okay. I mean, even if I failed it, I'm going to get, like, an A in the course. Well, I should because I got, like, A's on everything else. Also, since we're going down to school, we're going to go back to my dorm. Uh, as I said, two of my roommates tested positive for COVID. Obviously, we're going to wear masks in there. Thankfully, I wasn't there that much last week, so I'm not as concerned. Obviously, I'm getting tested weekly for the next two weeks. Um, but, like, I've taken, like, three tests. They've all been negative. Um, for the past few days, so not that concerned, but we're ready. We're going down there, and we're just gonna spray the whole place down. Um, especially since we're going on vacation. Uh hey guys, so it's the next day. It's currently 3:09, and right now I'm ordering some sushi for lunch because it's I'm really hungry and I can't wait for dinner anymore. So yeah, I'm looking at some other stuff that they have because. I don't know what I want. 
But yeah, um, I just got a 90 on my last worksheet for pre-calc, so my grade stayed the same, which is good. My exam opened, I haven't taken it yet, so after I get food, I'll probably take it. This is the Godzilla roll. This is spicy tuna. Hopefully it's good. Okay, I didn't really close it today because I didn't really do anything. Um, I just took my math final. I think I failed it. But, um, I see a seven day to pass the class. I will be honest, I slacked a little bit in pre-calc. I shouldn't have, but if I get a 70, I will pass the course. That's all I care about. However, it says it's going to be graded on April 18th. I don't think that's uh, going to happen because considering it is December. So I don't know when the actual grades is going to come out. But I would assume it's probably going to be after the grades are put in because obviously I guess they'll probably just bang us all out at once. But yeah, so that final's done. I just have to do the rest of my writing stuff. So it is currently 5.30. I only have one more assignment to do and then I'm done for the semester. <sighs> but my diner are going to go do frisky fries before we go to the movies. We're only going to see Eternals tonight. We're going to see... Next week he's off for three days, so we're going to see Ghostbusters then. We're going to do two, but um, it was just a mess today. Hey guys, so it's currently 1.30 in the morning. Carmen actually just left. She came here while I was at the movies and started baking. So she was here when I got home. <laughs> so that's good. We got frisky fries. They were good. Movie was good. And we're going to see Spider-Man tomorrow. Well, technically today. And okay, guys. So it is currently 1.50. I just woke up not that long ago. It's Sunday, December 19th. My dad and I are going to see Spider-Man at 9.45 tonight. came last night as I said I made cookies. The ones she made for us are over there. She made like 55 cookies. But I got my exam grade back and apparently I failed it. Like really bad. I don't agree with the grade. So I'm going to email her just to like clarify like, you know, this, this is actually my grade. Because it says a 77 out of 200. To me, the 77 out of 100 would sound more accurate to what I thought I got. So I just want to, I mean, if I failed it, I failed it, but I just want to like clarify, like I did not think I did less than a 50. So I mean, if I did, I did, but we'll see, but we're going to go get Starbucks now. Yay. So it's 420 and I emailed my professor about my grade. Turns out I was, I thought that was what happened. The grade was a 77 and I guess it, the program, like the computer didn't put it out of 200, so it should have been like a 154 out of 200, which would equal a 77, like percentage wise. So I passed pre calc and I had a heart attack all day, but I passed the class. <sighs> Dude, the amount of heart attacks I had today for that class, oh my god, because like I thought I passed. Like I was pretty confident that I passed. So. I passed pre-calc, so that means my GPA is going to skyrocket, and now I'm just waiting for two more classes to fully grade everything, but yeah, I'm like so happy right now that I passed, <laughs> but yeah, right now I've just been playing games with Carmen, but when all else fails, if this is a good lesson. If you don't agree with your grade and you have questions, make sure you email your professor, because things you never know. Second time we're at the mall. So now we're going to see Spider-Man. Apparently our movie is sold out, so this is going to be interesting. Okay guys, in true Caitlyn fashion, I did not do an outro to this video, so we're going to do it now. Um, to kind of summarize what happened pre-calc, I got 38 originally, and I was shocked because like I full-on failed the course then, and I was like, I didn't think I got 38, I thought I passed, especially because a lot of it was like domain and range type of stuff, and like I know how to do that. So I was really concerned and like confused. And then I saw some girl on TikTok. TikTok saved my ass. So I saw some girl on TikTok who was in the same course as me. Cause she's like that things like the sound for good luck. And she's like, it didn't work. And she got 34 and she thought that she did good. And I was like, you know, I got a 38 and I swear I got like a 70 something. 
So I emailed the professor and she goes, yeah, for some reason it just went in wrong. So it worked out because in the end I passed pre-calc. So I passed all my classes and especially like, it's been a long semester, but I'm grateful that I passed everything. Um, spring semester starts at the end of this month, which is January right now. Um, we'll see what happens. I'm not too confident that we're going to go back. Um, I know we'll probably still have a mask mandate, so that's, I don't care about that. I just want to know if we're going back to person because in-person learning is better for me, but you have to do whatever is safest. Um, yeah, I think that's it. So other than that, I hope you all are happy, healthy, and staying safe. I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.